What's inside a black hole? Imagine a place where the rules of physics, the very foundation of our universe, cease to exist. A region so mysterious, so terrifyingly unknown, that even light, the fastest thing in the universe, cannot escape its grasp. This is the realm of a black hole. A cosmic predator lurking in the shadows of space, devouring everything that ventures too close. But the question that has haunted scientists and dreamers alike is this. What lies inside a black hole? To understand the abyss that is a black hole, we first need to grasp how they are born. Black holes form when massive stars, at least 10 times larger than our sun, reach the end of their life cycles. These stars undergo a supernova explosion, a violent event that scatters their outer layers into space. What remains is a core so dense, so heavy, that it collapses under its own weight. Gravity becomes so intense in this collapse that nothing can withstand it. The star's remnants compress into an infinitely small point called a singularity. The event horizon, a one-way trip. Before we plunge into the singularity, we need to talk about the event horizon, the point of no return. This is the boundary that surrounds a black hole, and once something crosses it, there's no escape, not even light. Traveling at 186,000 miles per second can break free from the event horizon's gravitational pull. From the outside, it appears as a pitch black sphere, a perfect void against the backdrop of space. To someone falling into a black hole, passing through the event horizon would seem uneventful. They wouldn't feel any sudden change or see anything spectacular at that exact moment. But from the perspective of an outside observer, the person would appear to freeze in time, as though they were stuck just before the horizon, with their image gradually becoming redder and dimmer until it faded away. Spaghettification, the torturous journey in. As you get closer to the event horizon, things start to get weird. Imagine you are falling feet first into a black hole. The gravitational pull on your feet would be immensely stronger than the pull on your head. The result? your body begins to stretch, elongating into a grotesque shape like a piece of spaghetti. This horrifying process is known as spaghettification. The tidal forces would tear your body apart atom by atom long before you even reach the singularity. But let's assume for the sake of exploration that you could somehow survive this unimaginable torment. What happens once you cross the event horizon and continue your descent toward the singularity? This is where things get truly terrifying, not because of what we know, but because of what we don't know. The singularity, a point of infinite density. At the heart of every black hole lies the singularity, a point of infinite density where the laws of physics break down completely. Here, space and time themselves are crushed to a single point, a mathematical impossibility where the known equations of general relativity no longer apply. It's a place where all matter, all information is crunched into an infinitely small space, yet with infinite mass. But what does this mean? The very concept of infinity defies our understanding. It suggests a place where anything and everything is possible, where the very fabric of reality unravels. Some scientists speculate that inside the singularity, the dimensions of time and space could collapse or reverse, meaning that time might flow backward or split into multiple timelines. Others propose that the singularity could be a gateway to another universe a theory rooted in the idea of the multiverse, a vast network of infinite universes, each with its own unique laws of physics. Yet, all of this is pure speculation. No one, not even the greatest minds in physics, can definitively say what happens inside the singularity. The equations we rely on to describe the universe, Einstein's general theory of relativity, simply break down at this point. It's as if the singularity exists outside the realm of our understanding, a forbidden zone where logic and reason cease to function. Time dilation, a glimpse into eternity. Time behaves strangely around black holes. The closer you get to the event horizon, the slower time passes relative to an outside observer. This effect, known as time dilation, means that someone watching from a safe distance would see you slow down as you approach the event horizon. To them, it would seem as if you were frozen in time. But for you, time would feel completely normal. The deeper you go, the more intense this time distortion becomes. If you could somehow survive the journey into the singularity, time itself might come to a complete stop. It's a mind-bending concept. What would it mean for time to stop? Would you exist forever in a frozen state of consciousness, trapped in an eternal moment of descent? Or would time reverse, as some theories suggest, pulling you back out of the black hole in a bizarre loop of cosmic recycling? The firewall paradox, the burning edge. 
One of the great unsolved mysteries of black holes is the so-called firewall paradox. According to quantum mechanics, there's a chance that the event horizon might not be as harmless as it seems. Some physicists argue that instead of slipping seamlessly through the event horizon, you would encounter a searing wall of fire, incinerating you before you could even experience spaghettification. This theory stems from a conflict between general relativity and quantum mechanics. General relativity suggests that you wouldn't feel anything special as you cross the event horizon, while quantum mechanics, which governs the behavior of the tiniest particles in the universe, suggests that information about the matter falling into a black hole can't just disappear. This leads to a paradox. If information can't be destroyed, then something catastrophic must happen at the event horizon to preserve it. Hence the firewall, a barrier of intense radiation that burns anything that tries to cross it. However, this paradox remains unresolved and many scientists are skeptical of the firewall theory. The truth, like so much about black holes, remains hidden. Wormholes, portals to another universe? While black holes are often portrayed as cosmic destroyers, some theories suggest they could also be gateways portals to other parts of the universe or even to other universes altogether. These hypothetical passages are known as wormholes. If black holes connect to distant regions of space-time, they could theoretically offer a shortcut across the cosmos. In the case of a wormhole, the singularity at the center of the black hole wouldn't be a point of destruction, but rather a bridge to another location in the universe, or another universe entirely. While this sounds like science fiction, the equations of general relativity allow for the existence of such structures. The problem is that wormholes would likely be incredibly unstable, collapsing the moment anything tried to pass through them. However, some scientists speculate that if exotic matter, particles with negative energy, exists, it could keep the wormhole open long enough for travel. If such particles could be found or created, we might be able to harness black holes not as destructive forces, but as tools for exploration, opening up the possibility of interstellar or even interdimensional travel. The end of time, a universe devoured by black holes. Black holes don't just exist as isolated monsters scattered across the universe. They are an integral part of the cosmic life cycle. In fact, it's believed that at the center of every galaxy, including our own Milky Way, lies a supermassive black hole, billions of times more massive than the sun. These colossal black holes have the power to shape galaxies, influencing the formation of stars and the structure of space itself. But as the universe ages, black holes may become more than just cosmic landmarks. Over trillions of years, as stars burn out and galaxies collide, black holes will continue to consume whatever matter remains. In the far, far future, the universe could become a desolate wasteland filled with nothing but black holes. These cosmic titans would slowly evaporate through a process called Hawking radiation, named after the physicist Stephen Hawking, who theorized that black holes can lose energy over time. As black holes lose mass, they shrink, eventually vanishing in a final burst of energy. But by this time, the universe would be unrecognizable, a cold, empty void where time and space have lost all meaning. The Great Unknown Black holes represent the ultimate boundary of human knowledge. They defy our understanding of the universe and push the limits of our imagination. What lies inside them is a mystery that may never be solved. Are they portals to other worlds, gateways to new dimensions, or cosmic traps that consume everything, even time itself? The truth is, we don't know. And perhaps we never will. Black holes remain the dark hearts of the cosmos, silent, cold, and unforgiving. They are the ultimate reminder of how much we still have to learn about the universe and the terrifying forces that govern it.